Oh, here's the Illuminati guy, if that's what that guy is saying. The one that, that guy who came on, whoever that was, said Trump 2024 is on still. If this guy, if Trump is part of that top thing, mm -hmm. that's why he wants to get back we in the in office. Because he will trouble. be, he would literally be running the country. We are in trouble. The Illuminati would be running the I'm country. I'm going to tell you this, everybody. You know what he could be? Because he is in entertainment. I can tell you, I'm going to tell you this, everybody, and you really, we've been saying this pretty much. If he does make it as the commander in chief again, this will really see how much you trust in God, God of Abraham, Isaac, and Jacob. Your faith will increase, I tell you. Yeah. You have no choice. <laughs> well, I'm just going to mention him real quick. Uh -huh. He did, uh, um, he does his town halls. He has no choice because he has to. Mm -hmm. He has to raise money for his defense, his um, attorneys. And he also has to keep his name out there so he can win. He has to win. Mm -hmm. If he doesn't he's win. He's still getting money support, though, from people. Yeah. Because they love him. So it says, former President Donald Trump once again quoted Vladimir Putin, his boyfriend, mm -hmm. during a campaign rally after the Russian leader earlier this year alleged the former president's criminal indictments show the rottenness of American political system. So he's saying his boyfriend is saying, what y'all doing to me is wrong. And America's horrible. Vladimir Putin is saying we're horrible. No, think about the guy it. who sends people to uh to the desert. I I here on on this on this part of it, I agree. Y'all got to look at how Putin handles Russia. Yeah, how many people have come forth? He's whatever. Yeah, he's and you don't see them no more. You don't see them no more. They family members is gone, and that's what they he disappear. wants. Here, he feels like Trump should have that same. Anyone that speaks against the leadership in that country, which is Putin, yeah, negative, all could be true. Yeah, you don't see them no more. They yeah. disappear. So it says that's what Trump wants during Saturday's campaign stop in New Hampshire. Mm -hmm. Um, alleged that President Joe Biden is a threat to democracy. That's what Trump is saying. Um, before adding, even Vladimir Putin says that, Biden. <laughs> <laughs> when do people start loving Vladimir Putin I don't in know, Russia? Because of Trump. <laughs> the mega people. They hated him before. They couldn't stand oh Russia because Trump is friends with Vladimir. Now all of a sudden they love Russia. We love his friends. If that's okay. his friend, we love his friends. Yeah. Um, Russia, because it shows the rottenness of America political system, which cannot pretend to teach others about democracy. <laughs> Putin made the comments at an economic forum in Russia in September. Trump has long alleged without evidence that the four sets of the criminal charges he faces are campaign interference from the Biden administration. Now, I do believe that. I told you I believe that. What? It doesn't mean that what he's doing is wrong. Mm -hmm. He's still wrong. Mm -hmm. But I do believe that if he wasn't running for president, nobody would be Probably prosecuting him. Yeah. The former president has been indicted in Washington and Georgia in connection with efforts to overturn his 2020 election. Now, if Trump gets into office again, I will tell you this. There will not be another election. He will be president for the next 20 years. Mm -hmm. He will see. He will not leave like last time. You would have to find a way to get him out of the White House. You know what movie is coming out in April of 2024? I can't remember the name of it. Mm -hmm. It's about the different certain states want to be separate and they separate themselves. Yeah, it'll be Texas and California, maybe or whatever. No, Texas. Texas, it's Texas for sure. And that movie is actually showing. What could happen with our military being split? Because the commander in chief would be would have to deal with I don't it. Know what's gonna happen? That movie they say that's scary because they really think that that could be pro prophetic as well. I think that again, whoever is president, mm -hmm. God is gonna make it where you need to know God. Yeah, because with either one of them, it's bad. Yeah. I see both Any roles. leadership is going to be bad over this because as the country is changing direction and things that we're doing and even within uh, international um, policies and what's going on in Israel, what's going on in Ukraine, what's going to happen in China. We still got that China bomb ready to explode course, with Taiwan. Um, so you never know. Fred Flintstone, you know, came out and had to say something. Oh. Um, he says Putin, and, uh, uh, he said Trump is now siding Putin as a character witness, a guy who murderous thug all around the world. 
That's his character witness. He loves <laughs> he loves Putin. He likes the power that Putin has. I understand that. Are we surprised? Then the other thing that he did during his speech, again, mega people, they listen with two brain cells, mm. is he quotes um, Hitler a lot. Yeah, he does. He kept yeah. talking about how these people that's coming over here illegally are going to poison mm -hmm. our blood. Mm -hmm. What does he mean, poison our blood? Well, you know, what America, does that mean? The history of America is white. Hmm. Is he America talking about his again. blood? Make, make America great again. There was a time in America where the white man stood proud and strong. Hmm. <laughs> <laughs> and they have all, there has always been rumors, and I believe it, that he has a book of uh, Hitler that is, he go he reads, he loves Hitler because mm -hmm. Kanye loves Hitler. And Kanye loves Trump. They, love they got the, that in common. They love the power that he had, the influence that he had. Think about it. Hitler had influence. Yeah. For people to follow him, even to to, to do away with a, a race of people, that's influence. And you start to sit there and you think, wow. And you know what? If I was a Jewish person right now, I would be nervous. Because anti-Semitism is showing its head again. It really is. And because of what's going on in Israel. It actually never died. No, yeah. it never died. But people feel comfortable saying it. Back in the day, I'm not back in the day, what's going on now with Israel and Gaza, it's making those people, the same people that when Trump became president, felt emboldened to talk about black people. Mm -hmm. He made a platform for them to It's to the same. Remember, they was quiet for a while. Mm -hmm. Then when Trump became president, all of a sudden there's Karens everywhere. Yeah. Um, the same thing with um, anti-Semitism. Mm -hmm. The people who don't like um, Jews or mm -hmm. anything like that, mm -hmm. because of what's going on with Israel and Gaza, they feel empowered now to say they can say now they don't like um, Jewish people mm -hmm. or people. They control everything or they this and they that. And I've always said, I, I told you, I look at what if you what if what you're saying is true? They control Hollywood. Mm -hmm. What do you care? Mm -hmm. They don't like anybody controlling anything, though. Because this, remember, make America great again. They got to go back to where they were in control. Indians controlled um, Dunkin' Donuts. They don't. <laughs> yeah, well, yeah, not the Native Americans, but that Indian group. Yeah, Asian. Yeah, you're right. And 7 Eleven. But still, the white man is in charge. <laughs> the white man owns the whole big. Big Seven Eleven that's 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 stationed in. Um, oh, okay, South I get what you're saying. Yeah, yeah. They just run them. They run the little shops. But who's over it? Who's the CEO? Well, that's the white man. Yeah. And that's not Jewish. Yeah. So what are they talking about? Make, make a under, under, if you really want to get down to it, if you want to go all the way up to the top of the umbrella, it's a white man mm -hmm. from Europe or somewhere. Mm -hmm. but so what are they talking but about? Japan is starting to buy a lot of our property as well. You're right. Oh, Chinese. China. Yeah. You're right. It's either going to be a Chinese man or a white man. So I guess <laughs> it's all about money. It don't matter to the white man as long as he gets money. You know what? Are Chinese people in the Illuminati? I don't know. That's a good question. Things that make you go, hmm. Are white are Chinese people in the Illuminati? Do they allow them in or do they want to be in? Do they like, no, we have our own. Mm -hmm. We want to conquer all of y'all, like back in the day. But we conquered every land. That's a good one. Mm -hmm. All right. Okay. So uh, again with him, just I'm sick of him. What time?